Hi, I'm Design Build Doug, and this is my blog dedicated to healthy high performance construction and contemporary modern design. Today I'm going to talk rebar with you. This is a uh, number four piece of rebar, meaning it's four eighths, um, also known as half an inch. And rebar is an intricate part of a concrete foundation. Um, our engineer has given us specifics on exactly how we're supposed to lay out all the rebar throughout this entire foundation. And in order to keep with those specifics, we have created a jig to, to put us exactly 12 inches on center with the spacing of all of our rebar. So if we check these, they are all perfectly 12 inches on center. The jig itself, in order to give us that 12 inch on center spacing, actually has to be a little bit smaller than 12 by 12. It needs to be 3 eighths of an inch less, long and wide. And so that puts it at 11 and 5 eighths of an inch. And voila, we've got it perfectly fitting in there. And again, this measurement right here, 12 inches on center. The whole reason that we want to be so meticulous about this 12 inch on center measurement is because we don't want to compromise the compressive strength, which is the, the ability for this concrete to bear a load on top of it, uh, or the, the tensile strength, which is the lateral strength of this concrete. So we use this right here. Um, we've used this number three rebar which again was based on the engineer's recommendations and it's all sitting on this lovely stego wrap which is this 15 mil poly which is a vapor barrier and really going to prevent any sort of moisture from flowing up and affecting our wood floors in this home. Um, this jig helps out, very handy tool, I do recommend it and I also recommend following all the recommendations of your engineer. Adios amigos.